as you're heading out, by the way, Wilma says, um, uh, Gorka, would you mind, there's some stuff under the TARDIS that we'd love to move into the base. And you see uh, Digby goes, well, 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 we'll move that stuff, that's okay. And you see he says, We're, we just, um, uh, you know, just to let you know, bud, uh, uh, you know, you were you were gone for a couple months, and we uh, had some friends over while you were gone Swingers. for a while over the summer, <laughs> and we were working on some projects, and we had some gear, Swingers. and uh, we had some gear around Six. the tree, and so, but we're gonna have a lot of guests and strangers and people around, so we're just gonna throw all that in the cellar. Um, and I just want you to know that you're okay to invite, we're not gonna embarrass you, we're not gonna, you know, put you in a weird, um, but just there's some there's some gizmos and gadgeroos that gotta get put in the in the old basement room. But you guys got that, right? Yeah, we're gonna take, yeah. I don't got, have to go, I don't have to help with that, right? <laughs> <laughs> and and we and, and you see Wilma says and we and I shouldn't have asked and I just Are I was thinking here? I'm just I'm just stressed. And... Are those friends going to be at this festival? There's going to I want to say. What you the know, fuck are we doing? No, <laughs> no, no. You Sorry, see, goes, just... whoa, whoa. And you see that, uh, you see, Gorbeck says, Gorgug, it's not, it's not a weird, look. They're, they're, Gorgug's uh, eyes are darting between the darting biological between the, parents. Yeah. Of, <laughs> <laughs> and, here, and you see, you see, uh, Gorbeck, yeah, Gorbeck goes, look, they're, all the stuff they're talking about, they, that's not what the festival's about. Look, the festival celebrates bodies. You know, there's a nudity tent, but that's not sexual. That's just about admiring each other. So I'm just like having to study a lot lately. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not sure that I'm equipped for this conversation right now. Listen, bud, you don't have to go in the nudity tent. Okay? I know, I know I don't. <laughs> okay, but, if, but again, it's non-sexual. It's just about a place to be There's free. just a tent where people are nude. <laughs> Just sit in a hot tent together. Well, their music's playing and it's just a place to fit. You know, we live in a pretty stifling society in a lot of ways. And there's and they nothing- feel free in a big tent. Yeah, well, and because we want to be cognizant of people's boundaries. Okay. But, you know, clothing, you know, that's not, I didn't sign a contract when I was born saying I wear clothes forever. There's nothing wrong with a body. What is that? What does any of us have that no one's ever seen before? That's that's true. Um, I guess I just didn't really <laughs> think that much about what this festival was. Uh, it's great. Music's great. So I guess my friends are coming too. <laughs> <laughs> Underneath all of the tarps. No. Oh, no. <laughs> Underneath all of the tarps. Don't do this. <laughs> Don't do this. <laughs> Think about it. Think about it. <laughs> is it Are you late? sure? Is it too late? Can yeah, Rick, does Rick have other stuff? Sure. So does Rick have other stuff? Gorgug. Think about all the weeks they've done working on this. Please think about it. <laughs> is it a giant milking machine? I'm texting this supporter right now. Screeching out from various tarps and machines. Oh, there's a nun with a dildo. <laughs> is that one of your parents? Would you one of your parents is a dildo wielding nun? nun. <laughs> Absolutely not. Unless <laughs> it's both my parents on, on each top other of shoulders. each other. <laughs> it's kind of fun that it's a mower. Is it? <laughs> and you now mowed. it's like, yeah, you get mowed by it. Your loan is shorn, my guy. I'm trying to figure out the other pieces. Maybe I don't want to. Well, it's like dildo, feather, butt plug, and then I don't, and then I guess lube gun. Oh, wow. You, know you got it. it. Well, I've had fucked. sex before. <laughs> um, I gotta get on that. This is how the audience fun. finds out. <laughs> sex before. <laughs> I've had a little sex. I've had a little sex. <laughs> See, um, freaking cool. A number of other bots arise under Grix's command. Okay, they're more normal. <laughs> <laughs> they're a little oh, more normal. Okay, that one though. I'm oh. sorry, I have this to. This one isn't sexual, but feels sexual. That might be sexual. <laughs> this one's for the sapiosexual. Yeah. <laughs> um, and that's just a fisting machine. Now that's sexual. That one is quite sexual. Wow. Um, it float too? Uh, it is flying. It's a hovering, flying. These parents know how to have sex, <laughs> as someone who uh, knows. You see that, uh, again, Wilma and Digby both go, again, this stuff was all put under a tarp. It was all supposed to stay under the tarp. How, you know how to secure a tarp. <laughs> Wait, so they were like into like 
fucking machines or am You're I just missing like, do you something? really want this? <laughs> I need. Will you tell me yeah, you're, well, you've yeah, had sex? You. <laughs> <laughs> he just goes ruthless. So they were <laughs> into <laughs> so they were tinkers, like, but like horny tinkers. Yeah, dude. You just you just realize. Yeah, we've that? never asked what how they make their money. Or That's true. They tinker. Oh, they can. <laughs> is able that explains docking in freshman year. That's true. Yeah. That's very true. Uh, this is not anything we didn't know about the Thistle Springs. Well, we didn't know that they fucked each other. <laughs> I just thought it was a, an area of academic interest. <laughs> it is also that. So these bot and then the other one is going to close with Fabian. Oh, lame. That's the least sexual one, so you're <laughs> not thinking. Yeah. It's just kind of like a weird actually, flag you know, keg. I'm a. Uh, I'm. I'm excited to be attacked by this one. You know. <laughs> okay, that is. I feel like it'll just stab me normally. Take you know. Twenty-one fucking damage. Uh, Fabian, <laughs> you take four. I don't. Is there, do you have any way of getting these machines offline? Ah, uh, we'll we'll try to deal with the lawnmower. Okay. Um, <laughs> oh my god. Um, okay. They want that one intact. Yeah. <laughs> no one touch the lawnmower. It's been a personal fave. You have two rounds. Yeah, no one to it. Um, Digby looks at <laughs> looks at um, uh, at Wilman says, "I'll go for the lawnmower. You go for that." And he points at the sort of hovering, menacing uh, one in the corner. And he said, "Hey, was always your favorite." And. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and takes off. pictures of this, sending it to Porter. <laughs> we got him. Uh, <laughs> we got him. We got him, Porter. Um, yeah, you see, uh, Wilma goes and grapples the sort of hovering. You can see clearly there's like a Sibian strap to the top of it and just wrestles it. And she's like, ah, don't you hurt any of my son's friends. And you see that Tigby lawnmower is going to come for Riz at this point. Two attacks coming in, Riz. One hits for 13 points of slashing damage. Why did your parents put oh. something slashing on the dildo machine? Yeah. I really can't answer that question. <laughs> and I'm really mad at it's you. It's the lawnmower asking. part of it. It's the I'm lawnmower really, part of it. I'm really mad at you for asking. Uh, Adine, you take six points of damage. Adine, you're, you're kicking a man while he's down. <laughs> <laughs> Principal Griggs. Um, disintegrate me. <laughs> Please. 